don't know, I'm not a big fan of this look right now. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I... Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Cosmina and I'm making beauty videos. So if you're interested in that, please subscribe and ring that bell button for future notifications. Today we, I reviewed Tati Beauty and uh, this is the eye look that I came up with. So if you're interested to see how that, how I came up with that, keep on watching. All right, y'all, let's cut into this and just see how everything looks like. I'm excited. Yay. Okay, so if you haven't heard about Tati by now, you should have, first of all. <laughs> Second of all, Tati just released this uh, amazing palette that I think I paid $48 for it, plus shipping, which came around $57 or $58. So I'm excited to see it. I am, yes, there we go. <laughs> yeah, she's so beautiful in this picture, oh my God. She is gorgeous. So, um, I've seen from other people that usually this the palette comes in this paper, which it's absolutely amazing if you ask me because it's very recyclable. And then inside it says, beautiful is your story to tell. All right, so tat now, there's a plastic bag on top of it. This feels really good to the hand. Ooh. Now like that Tati Beauty, you can actually feel it with your hands as well. Like you feel the script on it. So that's how it looks like. I'm gonna take this cover off like that. And then in the corner right here it says volume one. Oh my god, look at my prints already. <laughs> There you go. Let's get to see this baby. Are you ready? Oh my god. Wow. Look at that. So beautiful. I cannot wait to play with these. I've been having, I'm, I'm a little late to the game, I know, but first of all, I received this late. I got it like, I think four days ago. It came in at the same time with some of the collection from Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star. Uh, I had to choose, but the thing was, first one was Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson that, was, that arrived that day, and then later on, Tati arrived, and I was like, I'm just gonna do it in the order they arrived. And uh, I didn't have any time to do it afterwards, so I'm like, okay, today is the day. It's currently um, 8.30 a.m., so <laughs> bright and early, and I'm trying to do this before I go to work, but I wanna show you some really beautiful look with this palette because this palette is just absolutely gorgeous here just looking at the color story this is gorgeous you guys i don't know if you've seen other reviews probably you already seen some other reviews so you already know about uh there's there's four different types there's matte sequin metallic and glitter and there's memory ritual story suit Aura and Poet are the names of it. So we'll go through these and um, see what we end up with, right? So I'm gonna go with something all over my lid and um, just by looking at it, I'm thinking, I'm thinking Sood or Aura. I'm just gonna go with Aura. a really beautiful color very pretty you can't see much um, in the viewfinder but I can see it I mean it's really really pretty very natural of course it's a neutral palette so yeah really pretty all right next I'm thinking I don't want to go with oranges but then I want to go with a little bit of brown but then I want to go with uh, 
that gold is so pretty. From story, the metallic story is just bomb. Okay, um, yeah, I'm gonna go with a uh, sequin suit. Wow. Okay. I never had an eyeshadow like this. With the sequins like that. I don't know if the camera picks it up, but you there's like super teeny tiny glitter particles in it that makes it shine. It's just so pretty. Maybe when I'm gonna come closer, you're gonna be able to see it. Oh, uh, with a little bit with soothe. And I'm gonna go with metallic, but I'm just gonna apply with my finger with the story from metallic line. Hmm. Is that a good one or should I go with something else? Because this is gonna look all, all orangey. Okay, we're gonna go with metallic suit instead. That's how it looks like. I don't know, I'm not a big fan of this look right now. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I... Okay, let's apply a little bit of Sood Glitter as well. I'm just gonna go just a little bit. Tiny bit right here in the center. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna go with more glitter. When in doubt, add more glitter, right? Okay, and then I'm just gonna go in the inner corner. I'm gonna go with Aura. From the matte and a little bit the sweet sequin. Oh yeah, now it's better. Now it's rocking. I don't know how this glitter is gonna stay on, but I'm hoping it's gonna stay on. All right, so I'm gonna go with memory. From the mat. And let's try to utilize it as a eyeliner. Okay, so I added a little bit more of the glitter suit from the suit or suit glitter whatever it's called and now I just have to clean under my eyes because there's a lot of glitter under my eyes and I need to clean that up I don't know. I don't know, guys. I was having big hopes for this, and this is not not coming together. It's just not coming together. I don't know what to say. Okay, I'm gonna go with Rachel from Matt. I'm just go under my eye right here. And then I'm gonna go in with. Um, Sequin Aura mm. Yeah, I don't know. Let me finish this other eye and then come back and just kind of show you how it looks like 
Okay, guys, so this is how it looks like. I mean, I still have a crap ton of uh, glitter under my eyes, which I really, really tried very, very hard to take uh, off, but it's not. It's pretty much staying there. Um, I don't know about this one. Honestly, I don't know what to tell you about this one, you guys, because I'm not sure about this one. Um, it looks really nice and all that, but I just, I, I feel like she missed the mark a little bit with the glitters because this glitters are just not staying put. And I'm not talking only the glitters, also the, the sequins or the metallic, whatever it's called, you get a lot of fallouts all over your face and just I don't like that look I don't like that look at all um but it does look really pretty I'm just I'm I'm not sure I I mean if I would have to say right now my opinion on it will say that I don't like it at least by now I don't like it <laughs> uh, but that's why I'm gonna try it again this is just the first impression um, as a first impression it, the colors are pretty and all that I just don't like the fallouts the amount of fallouts and also I don't like how the glitter goes everywhere like everywhere um, and I just I feel like I was lied to because the way she described it and some influencers describe it it was like oh you put it on it stays there it doesn't move at all you know you don't have any fallouts and anything like that and i'm like what are you talking about i had a gazillion fallouts from the glitter and everything else so i'm just like i don't know right now my mind is just going in circles so i was trying to figure out what the hell happened but uh, yeah that's how it looks right right now it's okay. The black is really pretty. I mean, that's how, what I use for my eyeliner. But yeah, the colors are kind of close to each other as well. I was trying to figure out how to make it work to make it look a little bit like an ombre with the colors that I was looking at. I was like, I don't know. Kind of all of them look like the same, you know? So I just don't know right now. But this is the final look. We'll see you next time with another video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a nice one.